Anyways, is it four yet? It's time. Is it time for business? Oh, it. It's 4 p.m. and that means it is time to continue my journey as Chris Redfield through the haunted mansion of the original Resident Evil. Ha! <laughs> okay. Anyway, enough of that. Enough of that hot action here. Let's get back to it. Uh, I originally started as Jill when I first began playing, and that playthrough went pretty terribly. I played for about an hour and 15 minutes and got really nowhere, to be honest. It was pretty bad. But I played yesterday as Chris, and I got significantly further. So, that felt good. That was good. It was nice. So I'm going to continue with Chris, even though he only has six spaces for inventory, which makes it kind of annoying. But, whatever. Here's Austin in here complaining about my bitching already, right out, right out the gate. Hey, buddy. Good to see ya. <laughs> I'm glad you can uh, bitch about my bitching. Okay. Let's continue the game. Uh, uh, uh. Alright, so I was dropping off some items because I found a room with a key in it, but I don't remember where that room is now because these fixed camera angles make it very difficult. Uh, ooh, yeah. <laughs> Why are you guys just dropping all this hate on me? It's just a waterfall of hate. Ah, oh! that's fine. I don't need. I don't need ink ribbons. I don't need ammo because I am a badass. I just shiv it. Yeah, having Chris, having six spaces for inventory is really hard. Having eight with Jill was really hard. Okay, anyway, where was I? Oh, yes, I remember now. I remember! <laughs> A little tasty treat for anyone who's seen Repo the Genetic Opera. If you haven't, then you don't get the reference at all. We could do some Twitch stream. That'd be fun. Yeah, let's get let's get a, some bros. We'll get three of us crammed in my office here, and we'll uh, we'll play a little something something, do some streamage. Uh, you can't drink while on Twitch though, so we'll have to get pre-dranked <laughs> before we stream. Ryan, you love Repo the Genetic Opera. What happened? You tell me now you don't love it. My God, man, what what hap What's happened to you? You've changed. <laughs> Okay, I gotta remember where I was going. I keep thinking this guy's gonna get up, and then I'm gonna be like, Hey dog, guess what? Blip! Blip! Knife in the butt. Is it this room? There's no knob on this door. Oh, well that makes it hard. No one... <laughs> Everyone loves Repo the Genetic Opera, Ryan. My god, man. It's just a fact of life. It's one of the essential no pieces of knowledge everyone has. Is this the right way? Maybe. Yes, I guess in theory you could y get glasses of water that were actually vodka, but... Oops. What? How is this... Okay, well, I'm confused. God, now I have ever long stuck in my head. I don't like root beer. I'm not going to drink root beer on this stream ever. Yeah, seriously, the re a lot of the textures look really good. The characters and backgrounds... Or the backgrounds look really good. The characters are, they're better, but they're not like drastic. But the backgrounds actually look like, what is happening? <laughs> I'm just going in a huge circle over and over. The backgrounds actually have definition, which is cool. When you look at a bookcase, it's not just a flat piece of muddy dirt. It's, it actually looks like there's books on it. Okay. Anyway. Yes, I'm down Mountain Dew. You name the time and place. I'll be there. Mm -mm 
Okay. Okay, now I remember where I'm going. All right. Come on, Chris. You've got those knee pads. You can do anything. A real hero comes prepared. Okay. What if he needs to get on his knees and perform several hours of something? <laughs> I'm trying to think of a job where you are on your knees that's not the obvious one you were all thinking of. <laughs> okay. I feel like this was right. I feel like I'm going the right way. It's locked. An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Oh, yeah. Well, look at these dramatic camera angles. Just get a sweet shot of Chris's bulge there for a second. Oh yeah, I, li I like it. I like it. Alright, this was not the room. This was not the room! There were, if you were watching yesterday, it was the room full of crows, if anybody remembers that. <laughs> Where I just spent like 15 minutes trying to knife crows out of the air. <laughs> Uh yeah. Those were that was a, that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. Mm. This might have been it. This might have been the one. Mm. That was good. Oh yeah, hey. Oh sh oh no. No, they're back. No more, please, no more crows. Yeah, you want some of this? There's one survivor. <laughs> no survivors. Come on. Come on, what you got? Blip. Oh, he's scared. He saw what I did to all his friends. He doesn't want any piece of this action. That's right, it was one of these rooms. Maybe this one. Maybe, mayhaps it was this fun. Yes, here it was. Okay, so there's a wicked death trap that's going to happen as soon as I grab this key, I feel like. I mean, just look at this thing. Look at this, come on. There's an inscription on the shield. Death is the true essence of bliss. Oh my god, that's some dark shit. That's some morbid shit right there. Someone blowing up my phone? Someone's blowing up my phone! What's up? It's Derek. Oh, I can't get over how fucking great this HD remake looks. <laughs> it's so... I just... Even if it didn't look any better, just having the op, the ability to play Resident Evil on Xbox One is all I really needed. I would have paid 20 bucks for that easy. Mm. May may whoever takes this emblem find peace and death. Will you take the mansion key? Yeah. Oh! Oh my god! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die now! <laughs> Austin, you lied to me. You lied to me. Knifing it did absolutely nothing. <laughs> oh, I got an achievement, though. Get used to it. Oh, that hurts my pride. Yeah, Austin, that, uh, knifing it did absolutely nothing. Now I have to start over from the checkpoint. You jerk! You big... Oh, no, no, no. Uh, yeah. And then I load the wrong game file. But at least we'll get to check out Jill's hot ass for a second. Fear can't kill you, but... But what?! <laughs> Alright, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Check that bouncing action out. Uh, uh, uh. Anyway, I'm done. I'm not a. I'm not sexist. Anyway, let's see. Okay. 
Get used to it. God. Ow, my heart hurts. Okay. Anyway, let's let's take that from the top. And now I'm not gonna take any advice from Austin. He can't be trusted. We've all learned that. I think we've all learned that Austin cannot be trusted. Uh, my life was in your hands, bro. So what's up? What's up with that? Fight your fear. I like the inspirational quotes at the beginning of every checkpoint. Every time you load the game, you get a nice little quote. Oh, thanks, buddy. Thanks for helping me out. <laughs> get out of here. Just get out of here. Love you. Canadianator, what's up, bro? Good to see you. See your name, at least. I mean, I don't get to physically see you, but I can imagine what you look like. And I imagine you are all pretty damn handsome. <laughs> and we're beautiful. Oh, God, these fixed camera angles are going to destroy me. <laughs> Holy shiza. Hot dogs and barbecue sauce is Derek. Hey, what's up, bro? How's it going? I love it. Hot dogs and barbecue sauce. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Let's try that again. At least now I know where I'm going because most of the first 10 minutes were me just trying to figure out what room I was trying to get back to. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm good. I'm pretty good at this game as you can tell. Dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun. Sometimes you have to add your own dramatic music. I wish I had a big, bushy, beautiful beard. I am jealous of that, sir. I can all I can grow is the weird Frenchy thing, but I try. I try. I've tried desperately. You probably can't see it, but I kind of have some sideburns going on there. They're a little hairier on the right side, but that's all I got, and that's like weeks. That has taken me weeks. <laughs> exactly, the Orlando Bloom slash Johnny Depp, depending on what film he's in. That's that's what I'm going for. The old J Dep or O Bloom. That way if they ever need extras for Pirates of the Caribbean, I will be there in a second. <laughs> I, maybe I have to put one of the other keys back in that slot to stop it. Or hold on. Bennett's Bennett's dent bent those crows are dicks, dude. You, the last stream, I literally sat in that room for 10 minutes, knifing the air. They would wait until I'd knifed, and then as soon as I put my arm back down, they would fly and attack me in the face. They were timing it perfectly. It was just pissing me off. Oh, God. Okay, so I did that wrong. Whatever I did last time was wrong. Is this room locked? Is that what was up? It's locked. An emblem. Okay. Hmm. I feel like I need something to place back here. May whoever takes this emblem find peace and death. Oh, I forgot to drop my stuff off at the box. No. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. That death, that death really fudged me. Really fudged me pretty good. Okay, well let's uh, let's try that again. I don't know why I thought knifing it would actually do anything. I guess it was my own fault, really. You know what? This crow's getting it though. No survivors! He's done. <laughs> yeah, Chris doesn't mess around. 
No time to cry, only time to die. <laughs> Inspirational words from Derek. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, see if I can get myself together here. I sp I remember this puzzle, but I don't remember exactly how to keep it from destroying me. <laughs> San Andreas. <laughs> Jesus. Now talk about a game I haven't played in ten years, but God, I loved it. Nothing like eating chicken and riding a bike all around town. <laughs> okay. Alright, anyway, I'm gonna drop some stuff off. And then I'm gonna continue my journey. Yeah, Chris's six inventory slots are kind of a joke. <laughs> Especially now that we're all spoiled by modern Resident Evil, where we can carry 200 things at once. Alright. Blap, blap. Okay. Anyway, let's try that again. One more time. With feeling. Oh god. Alright, Chris. Was that the door I came? Okay. I gotta... I'm bad. I'm really bad about getting lost in Resident Evil. <laughs> duh. 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 Huh. Uh, oh, excuse me. Oh, boy. Oh. Uh, oh, God. Mm hmm. Delish. Delicious. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, any of those would be perfect. I'll just start stabbing the wall to leave a trail for myself. It's just kind of the. I don't know. For some reason, the fixed camera angles always throw me off. I forget what doors are going to be down what hall when I see like this. I walk into a room and all I can see is my own face. Makes it a little confusing, but... I'm just like, I'm, like I said, I'm spoiled from modern Resident Evil. Got my laser sight over the shoulder aim. That definitely doesn't exist in this. You can either shoot straight forward or completely up or completely down. That's it. That's all you get. Oh, yeah. Freeze. Ah! Oh my god. That birdcage was foreshadowing this whole time. Ooh, how did I miss this ammo? Oh well. Luckily I have two free inventory slots. I gotta put on I gotta put on some chapstick. Sorry, hold on. Mm, 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 mm. The stay in California heat is just doing a number on my skin. <laughs> Oh, God. But it's da 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 da. Okay. So my plan is to, I don't know, take the key that I have. Wait, I think I can shoot the statue. Hold on. I think I can just shoot this thing. <laughs> uh, no thanks. I would rather not live in negative 30 degree Canada. I prefer a cool like 65, 70 degree winters here in Long Beach. <laughs> but it's, it's getting hot again, so... Oh god, I'm scared. Can I just shoot you? Oh, I'm dead. 
I'm so dead. I don't, I don't get what to do right now. As soon as I take it, it activates an Indiana Jones Temple of Doom style trap. <laughs> Clearly shooting it does absolutely nothing for me. Death is everything. God, this room is morbid. There has to be another, another component to this puzzle. There has to be something I'm missing here. There has to... Oh god, am I even going the right way? There's an inscription on the shield. Death is the true essence of bliss. Alright, let me look at my map. Let me see if there's somewhere I haven't been yet. I really need that key to get to most of the rooms I haven't been in yet. Hmm. Alright. Well, let me try that again. I don't know what I'm going to try differently, but... Will you take the mansion key? Yes. Oh my god. I forget, do the walls close behind me or just on my sides? Oh yeah, they... yeah, that shield guy. Fudge. Can't use that one. Gah. Ah! <laughs> Alright, well clearly I can't do anything here yet, so... Abandon all hope! Combine the keys. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it just for you. Actually, no. I'm sorry. I won't do it. <laughs> there has to be some. There has to be another key, like a, a doppelganger key somewhere, or something. But I feel like I've been everywhere else. Hmm. Hmm. I don't think so. Usually they're pretty obvious with things you can interact with. They'll say something corny like, hmm, there's a hole here. I wonder what that could be for. And then I say something like, to stick my dick in, son! <laughs> oh... God, that was aggressive. <laughs> Alright, what rooms haven't I been in? Pretty much none. They're all freaking locked. They're all flipping locked. There's a strange hole here. Went out, gunk, went a little, nan out, the battle, do 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 do. So that's where I push the statue down. Oh, Resident Evil, why are you so. Oh, what? Oh, well, yeah. Apparently, I haven't been in all the doors. Oops! Tells you. Oh, yeah, I know for sure. I'll never need this key again. Ooh, I'll use the old key. What's in here? Oh, we're getting somewhere, guys. Oh, oh, oh. Making progress. Oh, shit. Ooh, some herbs. Ooh, that's kind of cool. I can just... 
A stained glass window. The pattern in the center resembles a witch. That's scary! I don't remember if you cut open any of the paintings in this. I feel like there's got to be some sort of secret component to one of them. But it's been so damn long. But again, they make it super obvious when you can. Like, mm, something seems out of place about this painting. Maybe there's something I can use. Oh, you unlocked it. My god. Where is it taking me? Really? That's it? That was it? That cannot be it. There's gotta be something else out here. There's just gotta. Unless this is just a shortcut I unlocked. Oh yeah, but that was only one of the doors, that's right. This is, yeah. This was just a shortcut I used an old key to unlock. Oh yeah, I just circled around pretty hard. <laughs> that's okay, we'll backtrack. We'll get back on track by backtracking. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh! Oh, you son of a bitch! Time to knife his butt to make sure he's dead. Oh, he's done. It's locked. Oh, God. Oh, God, another zombie! This guy's going down hard. Let me just shuffle across. <laughs> Let me just stray real quick. Ooh, got him good. Oh, what? One shot? I don't think you're done. I don't think you're done at all. Oh. Okay. He's done. You unlocked it. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. oh, okay, cool. Yeah, we're getting somewhere now. <laughs> I want to say there's spiders down here, but I really don't remember. It's been so long. I always hated the spiders. I remember back when I was like 10, or when it, what, however old I was when I first played this game. I just wouldn't go into a room with spiders. Like I didn't beat the game till much later, because if there was a spider in a room, I just wouldn't go there. So I couldn't progress in the game. <laughs> it was pretty good. I feel like this is a save room? Maybe? Maybe? Perhaps. I hope so. Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. We're getting somewhere now. A well-used bed. Okay, hold on. Let me combine ammunition. Combine pistol. Blap. Then I can drop off my extra rounds. And I can take an ink ribbon to save my progress. I know, he's just like, ooh, a well used bed. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Mm. Let me just take a quick nap. Let me smell the pillowcase. Okay. Now I need to remember to drop off my ink ribbon. Bam. I'll take some of these key items just in case. Maybe this emblem. Maybe this chemical used on plants. We'll see. I don't know. We'll see. See if I need them. Oh. Sorry, I had to tweak my camera a little bit. Yeah, 
Yeah, in this, there's a uh, there's a big fountain you find, and there's a giant plant growing out of the fountain, and that's what you use the chemical plants on. Oh, what's this? There's nothing but cleaning products inside. It smells faintly unpleasant. Mm. You might be able to unlock it using an old key. Yeah, I'll use the old key. Thumbs up! <laughs> oh god. Oh. Oh. Seriously, use the cleaning products on the bed. For sure. Just some old furniture. And a grenade! <laughs> Come on, bro! Tell me you don't see the grenade? <gasps> Wait, is that a shotgun? Oh, that's right. Earlier I found a room with a shotgun on the wall, and then you grab it, and of course it activates a Temple of Doom-style trap, so you have to find a replacement to put in its spot. But soon I will have the shotgun. Basically, any game that has a shotgun, I'm going to use it. Oh, there's a fuel canteen. And an ink ribbon. Man, I'm finding all sorts of stuff. Wowzer, guys. Wowzer! Now I just have to learn how to control my character. <laughs> um. All right, let me go back. Let me dump some of this stuff off. Hope I'm. I have a feeling we're gonna start seeing some crimson head zombies. I don't know if you guys have heard about those, but. Basically, if you leave a zombie on the ground without burning it with the kerosene, they turn into crimson head zombies, which are stronger and faster than the, any before. <laughs> well, I do love Jim Carrey, so I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> Man, I have ink ribbons out the ass right now. Right out the ass. Hmm. Hmm. Inventory management, 90% of this game. Okay. I think I'm ready to rock and roll. Think I'm ready to rock. Think I'm ready to talk to you, baby. Think I'm ready to rock. Think I'm ready to show you my face. Okay. Face, that's not where you thought I was going with that, huh? I thought I was going to say something else that rhymed with rock. Oh. Mm. Is that really all I'm going to get down here? It's... There's got to be something else. There's got to be a key or something. I, ne I need something! Can you combine the keys with that emblem thing? I don't know. Maybe. I honestly forget what you do with this stupid emblem thing. Oops. Let's examine it. It's galled all around the outer edges due to frequent fitting. There's got to be like a perfectly sized thing that you use. Yeah, I tried to climb the ladder. You can't. Can't climb the ladder. Is that all that's down here? No, I need more. I need more. All right, well, I'm going to grab that shotgun then. I'm going to try to find out where that shotgun room was, so at least I can get that. Oh, 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 oh. Broken shotgun. Sweet. One of those statues did have a shield-shaped thing on it. Yeah, I'll, ca I'll carry it with me and see. Maybe I can use it in there. Carry that emblem around. They're covered in blood stains. My god. What horrors await me here in Resident Evil. Yeah, I need to get a new key to go anywhere. And I found one, but I can't figure out that trap. Hmm. 
I have Rocksmith. I've been thinking, I have it for Xbox 360, but I've been thinking about getting it for Xbox One so I can stream some live shreddage. Because that would be super fun to stream. Most of my streams are just me playing a guitar and singing anyway, so why not combine the two into one magical experience? Alright, let me go downstairs, try to remember where that shotgun room is. locked. An emblem of a helmet is carved into the lock. That's weird. <laughs> There's something in here, but you have to find like a step stool somewhere to get it, I believe. Something. Yeah, I've been playing guitar for like 12... 12 or 13 years now. It's been a while. Rocksmith's super fun. And shredding to the Megadeth track pack. <laughs> Playing along to some sweet Hangar 18 action. Wait, I can move this? Oh. Well, I take the handgun magazine. Uh, no. I know where it is now, at least. Need to save this spot open in case I find something good. <laughs> that close-up. Hey, sup, honey? You about to ride the Chris train to Pleasure Town? <laughs> yeah, the... The difficulty is just based, it was based on your player level with the first Rocksmith. So it would kind of like pick up on how you were playing. And if you're doing well, it would automatically increase the difficulty. So you couldn't really control it. Oh. Hmm. Do do that, do do that. Mm -mm. Okay, yes, this is the shotgun room. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. You don't even know. Will you take the shotgun? Yes, I will. And you know what I'll do? I'll be like, hey. Wait, no. No. Boop. There we go. Yeah, if you're at a beginner level, I would say bass is a little easier to pick up and play. Um, less strings for one, and uh, <laughs> typically there's not a lot of chords involved, which are when you're building your finger dexterity. That's the hardest part, is like being able to hold a chord and not have it vibrate violently. But yeah, bass is fun. I like bass. You just gotta start learning some funky slap stuff. Oh, save room. Sweet. Sweet home Alabama. Let's see. I might as well save. I have like 50 ink ribbons going on right now. Yes, yes, I'll use an ink ribbon. <laughs> I've got blisters on me fingers! Yeah, dude, get used to blisters. If you're just starting to play, you're going to get a whole lot of blisters. But that's a good sign. Eventually those blisters will turn into calluses, and then you'll be able to just shred for hours without your fingers bleeding. Yeah, you can combine the, the piles. 
As much as I love the shotgun, I'm gonna tuck it away for a little bit and try to find some items. Save it for a special occasion. Let's see here. Oh, that's right. That's the door. You can only go one way. God. Okay. Yeah, this is a game that's really easy to get lost in. So, so easy. What's over here? I think this is that room with the fireplace, I want to say. Yep, this is definitely the room with the fireplace in it. Need a key for that door so I can't do anything there. Let's see. All right. All right, brother. See you in a few. What is this wooden plank here? Is that something? There's a wooden... Okay, that's new. Wooden mount. There's a paper attached on the inside. Nothing is written on it. What the hell? So there's paper... Okay. That's something I walked by countless times <laughs> without even realizing yet. Okay. Let's go back this way. See what I can uncover. Well, yeah, one thing they did with the GameCube remaster is on the map, it'll tell you if you found everything. Like, if you look in your map and you're in a section that's highlighted green, that means you've gotten all the items there. Which is really cool. That makes it a lot easier. Mm, mm, mm. Right now I'm doing pretty bad. Not really sure where to go at all. Mansion third floor. Hmm, let's see. Let me try something here. Blue to blue blue. Says I haven't found everything in this this over here. Hmm. Hmm. Peculiar. Says I have not found everything out here. Gotta be something. Some kind of thorny plant you've never seen before. Hmm. They're putting a lot of focus on this. Well, I can't bust the window, so... Maybe just because there's the plants are still here? I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see here. I got everything in here. Did I get everything downstairs? I'm still shocked that we go downstairs and I can't progress at all. Yeah, I got everything downstairs.
I'm really unsure of what to do. There's paper. There's paper on the inside of this. And that's all it's going to tell me is it's, there's it's hmm. Hmm. It's nothing unusual. Hmm. I really don't know where I am going. Oh, baby girl. Welcome back, sir. I have done nothing. Well, I think I don't know if you were there when I found a wooden plank with a piece of paper on it that says nothing. I found that. Really unsure of what to do with that thing, but that's there. Got everything here. Oh. Don't have everything over here, though. Hmm. You might be on to something there, my good man. You might be on to something there. And try holding it over the fireplace to reveal hidden writing. Hmm. All right, let's see. Ooh, excuse me. I wish there was a quick button for the map, though. I wish you could just open up the map instantly without having to go to the menu. But whatever. Whatever. So here's this room. There's this room here. I don't know. I have... Death is the true essence of bliss. Hmm. Can't use that little shield. Can't use that. I don't... I need, really need this key to go anywhere, but... Nope. Nope. <laughs> Damn. Death is everything. I wish there was something I could push in front of it to keep it from moving. Because if this one back here didn't move, I could just run backwards. But... It does. So... So here I am. I'm stuck. I'm stuck! No! Death is the only the beginning. I wish you could, like, just grab this one and move it. Yeah, I can't combine it. can't do anything with that. Well, that is indeed a pickle. That is going to take me a minute to figure out. No, I tried shooting it. That's definitely not going to work. <laughs> Just going to cause me to die again. You've, there's got to be something. You either... I don't know. I don't remember. It's been way too long since I've played this game. I don't remember the puzzles anymore. Well, well, now... Do that. Do that. Do, do. Mm. 
There's this secret passage here which leads outside to this grave site where you find all these creepy faces. No, that's uh, I think that started in Resident Evil 4. <laughs> hmm. So there's this room over here. You put you put an arrowhead in this thing and it unlocks this like secret tombstone passage, but I got the book of curses in here. And there's this giant thing here. The following inscription is carved into the indentation. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. And so there's all these like faces over here. And then you fill these faces with the various components, eyes and noses and mouths. <laughs> but that doesn't help me right now. Okay. Time to get out of here. Time to leave this place. It's no good. Hmm. I swear there was like a ladder in this room. In the original, there's a ladder so you can climb up here and get what's in there, but... And no chainsaw guys in this one either. <laughs> can I shoot the sculpture or what? Like, hmm. Various art supplies. Oh, I'm always rocking a knife, son. You know me, dog. Blap, blap. But, uh, I am so lost already. Damn Resident Evil straight to hell. Why can't I just pull this thing and climb? Because you can climb on it, but... Still, I can't like. Oh, oh, Chris. Oh, Chris. Maybe if I push it like partly in front of it. Can I push it from behind? Giggity, giggity. Oh God. Oh, these fixed camera angles. Oh, jeez. Okay. Yeah. Yeah! There we go! A map of the mansion's first floor. The Funch. You got the map, okay. I've got the map, but have I got the touch? Don't get me wrong if I think you're all right. But that won't keep me warm in the middle of the night. So there's stuff back here, apparently.
An eerie picture of the mansion. According to that map, there should be something right here. Directly in front of me. Let me burn this picture! Yeah, the red means there's still items I haven't found yet. Hmm. But that map's nice. Okay. Well, there's not much in here. Yeah, I tried to burn it. <laughs> I saw it. You, you saw it. I tried to burn it. Can't. Doesn't work. But that won't keep me warm in the middle of the night. Alright, well, now that I have a map, let's see. Yeah, I've basically been everywhere that I can without having a key. Hmm. Hmm. Peculiar. But this room at the very end of the hall, you guys can't see what I'm pointing at, but there's something there that I can get into. And it says I'm missing an item, so let me try that. Let me try that. Gotta bust out my superior detective skills now. <laughs> Had to Google it to know what jam I was getting down on. One of these is locked. Is it you? No. This must be the one. This must be the one that leads me to my destiny. Maybe. Let me see. Yeah, so I should be able to go all the way down to the end of this and get somewhere, maybe. Bert Macklin, FBI. All right, let me just, I'm super OCD about checking my map. I thought, oh, there's something apparently in this room over here. What haven't I gotten here? What haven't I gotten here? Yes. The game appears to have ended in a checkmate. Is this it? Did I get everything in this room now? Cool, it was just some ammo. Real flopping cool game. I don't need any ammo. I'm putting a straight knife playthrough. <laughs> Knives out. That's all I need. Okay. No, Jesus. <laughs> the jerking when you enter a new position. Do 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 that. Do 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 So at the end of this hall, there will be a room, and apparently I don't have everything in this room. Apparently, I don't have everything in this room. Oh, it's just flipping herbs. Ah! I got a map of the mansion, second floor now. Huzzah! I was hoping for something a little bit cooler, like a key maybe, but I'll take a map of the mansion. Cool. Well, that's a little bit of a bummer. But perhaps I can investigate this map. Look for clues. All right, so. Second floor. Second floor. Maybe there's a stairwell I haven't gone down yet. Looks like there is a stairwell I haven't gone down yet. I don't know about that. I feel like I have. Oh, hey, what's up, man? QJ Shack? Shack? Shaquan? 
Jay Sh I don't I'm not even gonna try. I've just butchered the hell out of that. Dude, I know it's been a hot minute since I played Resident Evil. I just started playing again uh, the like two days ago and oh my god, I've forgotten everything. <laughs> this game is a nightmare to navigate. Alright, well let me try going over there to that stairwell I maybe haven't been to yet. But probably have. It's probably just a fool's errand. Yeah, if, it, if there's a red line, that means the door's locked. I don't have any new keys, because I can't figure out that damn puzzle. The giant knight with the spinning shield of death. Alright, so let me just drop off... Let me drop off some ammo here. Ah, oh, Let me grab an ink ribbon so I can save my game. God, seriously, the last time I played the original Resident Evil was when they released the GameCube remaster in 2002. I found, like, in one of the original tall cases a few months ago, and I put it in my PS1 just to boot it up. And I played, like, the first 20 minutes, maybe, of that, but... Oh, God. It was a blast from the past. The game did not hold up graphically, that's for sure. <laughs> No, it only changes blue when you've actually gone through the door. Which is upsetting. I know, I wish it would tell you, like, if you needed the uh, shield key, it would have a picture of a shield on the door. On the map, but it doesn't. <coughs> Oops, excuse me. Alright, I gotta go back up. Gotta go back up now. And which way am I going again? My god, this is a nightmare. <laughs> this is hell! This is my nightmare. Sorry, I had to take a mental break and just shred for a second. <laughs> okay. Oh gee, the original doesn't have a map? Are you sure? Are you sure that's a thing? I mean, I feel like there was a map in the very first one. No map would just... Dope. I can't even fathom that. I can't even comprehend no map. Okay, anyway, let's see. Let's see if I can... Oh, I just totally forgot where I was going. Hold on. <laughs> Duh. Just go straight. Okay. Jeez. These, these modern controls they've been hyping up are not the best. Oh, yeah. Dude, yeah. If I was a true gangsta, I wouldn't be using the map at all, but... I'm not getting so at all. <laughs> I'm trying to do this in the easiest possible way I can. I did easy mode. Uh, I mean, I guess Jill would have been an easier playthrough because she has the lock pick and she has more inventory spaces. But besides that, I'm doing I'm doing easy mode. I'm doing way easy mode. These fixed camera angles always throw me off too. I never know like where I'm freaking going. Where I'm freaking going, going down the street. Ooh, girl, don't know where I'm going, but I want you there with me. Yeah, do do ta 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 ta. Okay. So what is this apparent downstairs thing I haven't been to? I can tell you already I've been down here. I can tell you for sure I've been down here. Yeah, I have. There's nothing for me here. Do 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 do. Hmm. Does anyone watching remember how to do that puzzle where the key is in the floor, and if you grab the key, that spinning night shield guy comes and destroys you? Because I don't, and I feel like I'm just missing something really stupid. 
Because I need a key to progress. And that's that's a key. I've definitely found a to where a key is, but I think I've gotten everything in this room. Yeah. I've done everything down here. The map lies! <laughs> there was nothing for me down here. Okay, whatever. Yeah, dude, seriously, it's been so long. I don't remember a damn thing. Some of these puzzles are just... I remember the puzzle itself, but I don't remember the solution at all. I'll, I'll show you guys real quick the one I'm talking about. Maybe it'll refresh your memory and you can enlighten me on what the hell I'm doing wrong. Don't ever trust the needle! Why'd you have to bring me... Oh god, why'd you have to start me on my queen, queen's right kick? Don't, don't ever trust the needle. Is this the right door? Maybe. Yep. Okay. So I'll show you the puzzle. This is the one. There's a key in the floor, and when you grab the key, it activates this trap. But there, I haven't found a replacement key. I don't think I will find a replacement key. I think I'm just... I don't know. This here. This key. As soon as I grab it, it activates the shit storm. May whoever take this emblem find peace in death. Will you take the mansion key? No, because if I take this key, I will die. No. <laughs> Silent lucidity, classic queen strike. <laughs> oh, Jesus. So bad, but so good. Death is everything. Death is everything. No, dude. You can't stay on the side of it because the walls close in. No, trust me, dude. If it was that easy, I would have figured it out. <laughs> I just don't get it. I just don't know. I just don't know what to do. Yeah, because once you grab the key... The statue that's behind you scoots forward and the walls close in, so there's only one straight path. And you just get destroyed. At the beginning, I took Austin's advice to try to knife it. And, uh, that didn't work. Let me tell you, that did not work. No. This is, this is a key. I remember this specifically because you put it into place somewhere and it unlocks a door. I can't use the shield I have now to stop the, the spinning blades. Chris equips his shield for battle. Yeah! You shall not pass! Have we got everything in this room? Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah. Oh, God. Fixed camera angle is destroying me. Hey. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, you, got, you gotta have fun. You gotta have fun. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not Resident Evil 5 level Chris, so I can't just punch things until they explode. Yeah, I've killed a lot of dogs so far. Have I not gotten everything here? There's something I'm missing in this big room here. Let's see what it is. Let's see what I'm missing. There's the clock. I know you do something with the clock too, but I also can't remember that puzzle. There's an indentation where the emblem used to be. Cause there's this big thing here. When the two have run each other through, the path to your destination will open. Oh. oh! Oh! Now we're getting somewhere. A picture of two knights striking each other. The short sword has been thrust in the breast of one knight, while the long sword has 
pierce the head of the other. Okay, well they have struck each other through. I don't know what else you want from me. Don't ever trust the needle. Don't. Don't ever trust the needle. The needle lies! The needle lies! Oh, wait. Can I remove this painting? Can I knife this painting hard? This guy's cheating and looking up guides, huh? <laughs> well, that makes sense. I appreciate it. There will be a coin in the collar. Examine it and push a button and it turns into an imitation key. Okay. That's complicated as shit, but that's fine. Alright. Okay. Well, let me get to a save room so I can get my dog whistle. My dog... Oh, man. It's 512. It's 512. I've gone over an hour. I gotta shut this beast down. Oh yeah, I gotta go this way. Oops, I gotta go back the way I came. <laughs> God. That's true. That is true. That was a pretty cruel, pretty cruel trick of you. Oh, God. so long searching for carrots and for them to only be directly behind our house in Minecraft. Jesus. It was just cruel. That entire stream was cruel. Don't ever trust an. Am I going the right way? No. Oh, God. Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Alright, I'm going the wrong way. Screw this place. I'm out of here. <laughs> That's fair. I guess you didn't know why I wanted to carry it. That's fair. That's fair. I won't I won't uh bust your balls too hard. Too hard for that one. Don't ever trust the needle, the needle lies. Okay. We're making progress now. We're making progress. Got the map from that. Go to the save room, get my dog whistle, save my game, and shut her down. Shut down the old stream skis. And then tomorrow we'll be able to, we'll actually be able to do something tomorrow because I'll kind of know what I'm doing a little bit more. Baby steps. It's all it's all flowing back to me slowly but surely. Yeah, like I said, you guys missed the worst stream. My first stream is Jill. Oh God. Oh God. I had no idea what I was doing. I didn't even make it a quarter of this quarter of the way to this point. It was pretty pretty bad. Where am I going? Is this right? Mm hmm. This is right. Okay. God. <laughs> Navigating this mansion is hell. Oh, yeah, I totally did. I saw that. Thank you. Brian's like, here's a sign with some stuff for you. And I was like, what? But yeah, no, I appreciate that. Thanks for setting that stuff aside for me. <laughs> I laughed when I saw it. I was like, yes. I thought it was lost forever. Don't have a tr Okay, here we go. I'll get my inventory all prepared for the next stream so I don't pop in like I, like I did with this one, totally confused with what I'm doing. Okay. So let's see. So I need the dog whistle. I don't need the fertilizer yet, so I'm gonna just put that away. But I need an ink ribbon to save my game. 
Stone Typewriter, you can save your progress. Use the encryptment? Yes. Ah. I know you get different endings or something or different unlocks for beating the game with only with using less than three saves or using no saves or something. But I haven't been doing that. I've been saving pretty much any chance I can get. <laughs> but yeah, guys, this is where I'm going to shut down the stream for today. Thanks for watching part two of my Resident Evil playthrough with Chris. Um, if you guys missed the first part, I post all of the previous episodes on YouTube, so you can watch them on there. I will be doing the same with all of them going forward, and then I will be streaming some more at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, basically every day. I try to stream every day, but, you know, sometimes I like to pretend like I have a social life and do things. But yeah, if you guys have any suggestions for the stream, things you'd like to see strummed, let me know. Um, I will be streaming this to completion. This will be one of the first games I've done in a series like this where I just play from the start to finish all the way through. So I'm committed to this one. It's going to happen. Chris is going to conquer evil. But yeah, anyway, a huge thanks for everybody who tuned in today. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe to my channel. Give me some followers so I don't look so lame. And yeah, I will catch you guys hopefully tomorrow. All right. Peace out, guys. Super Smash. Oh, seriously, Super Smash. I have a, a buddy, and sometimes we do Super Smash streams. But um, I haven't hooked up my capture card on my new PC yet, so I would love to move the Wii U into the office and just get down on some Smash, because I've been playing that pretty hard, and that'd be super fun. But yeah, I'll, I'll look into it more. I'll seriously try to get some Smash up and running, because I'll be just running a Hurt Train with Pac-Man all day. Yeah, I have it on 3DS and Wii U. So, um, dude, a Wii U is worth worth it just for Smash Bros. alone. Like, it's so good. It's so, so good. The console version is, for competitive play, that's where it's at. That's where all the, like, the best players are going, playing it on Wii U. Because I love the 3DS version, but having a controller makes it so much better. Having a GameCube controller makes it so much better. But um, yeah, if you're looking for people to add on the 3DS, if you want to add me, add some other people, um, go to the, just Google what's your tag. It's uh, our gaming website. We have a list of everybody's uh, friend codes on there. If you want to add me and we can get down on some, some uh, Smash Bros action. And then, um, or you can just, if you Google search uh, 3DS friend code exchange, I think we have the number one post for it too. So you should be able to find it somewhere on there. But uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys later.